black artistry. From the way that we walk to the way that we talk. From the way that we dress and gain underdog success. There's an art to being black and it's something we're proud to express. It's black artistry. It's you and me. It's black expression. It's what the world don't want us to see. It is black artistry. We are what some may call the shiz naive. And going black in the past, because of them, because of them I can be me. Because of them I am free to be a part of this black artistry legacy. Cause you see Gordon. Gordon left me with a stupid trigger finger and a sharp eye. Leaving a photography legacy for generations even after me. And then he took some words, some pronouns, adjectives, and verbs. And he doubled the art in his heart. And that's how he made his mark. And now, I'm making my mark. Just like Augusta Savage did when she sculpted the harp. I'm just sculpting artwork better known as poetry. And it's not just for me. It's the black artistry I'm trying to tell y'all is for you and me. Because our ancestors. Our ancestors created this savagery for us to supersede this thing called the legacy. Our ancestors created this savagery for us to supersede this thing called the legacy. And it's black expression because color is life. And Alma Thomas taught us that when she decided to teach the kids and keep painting and rearranging the history of blacks. And to take it back again, I'm talking way back to when Sojourner asked, ain't I a woman? Didn't she paint the perfect picture? For here I am, the birth of her word. For I am a proud black woman, pure walking black artistry.